Yo, you want a slice of pizza? Oh yeah, dude. Yo, come take a slice so of pizza. Dude, it's been it's... such a long day. Sight is the new gritty steering wheel. What the fuck? <laughs> Pulled up to the airport. We can't even print out our boarding passes. Every time we try, it says printing failed. And then the Air Canada kiosk over there, no one is in it. It is just straight abandoned right now. So we're going to literally miss our flight that takes off in 30 minutes. They literally, no one there. there's no one there. We finally have boarding passes, like three hours later. And our flight is in one hour. What should have been a like early morning 6 a.m. flight is now a late morning 10 30 a.m. flight. Isn't too bad. I really do wish I got my sleep back though. There's a little plane back there. We gotta go to our connecting flight in Vancouver to start out. So we're taking a small hour part one flight. Not freak you out or anything, but like these are like the small jets that usually like go down, I feel like. Be quiet. <laughs> no more talking. I feel like in movies, it's usually these are the ones that never survive. <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay. We won't put any more toxic thoughts in your brain. No, I, yeah. <laughs> So, Vancouver, Canada. Toronto, we are inside of you. It is 9 p.m. We've literally spent the entire day just out traveling, trying to get from point A to point B. But we're finally making good ground. About to, we gotta go find our, uh, our ride for tonight. Don't know what it's gonna be. Whoa. I literally just got it cleaned up today. I've been running around left and right. Oh my god. You know, I've been picked up by a couple things here and there, but I don't think I've ever been picked up by basically a street build on air suspension. I heard the cups go up, I heard the air suspension. On the raise wheels. Oh man. We're good. She's a little she's a little feisty. What would you say is like the most common build around here? Or or cars that you would see more so around here than other areas? Subaru still. A lot of Subaru. Dang, a lot we're of we're Hondas. still in home. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of Subarus, a lot of, uh, there's Evos of course, but they're they're a rare breed now. Yeah. Not I have a thing for white on white cars. I think it's a definitely a perfect look. And Only one thing I hear from everyone, how do you aren't you annoyed with the wheels getting dirty? I'm like <laughs> Yeah, but when you clean it, it looks hella fresh. It's, it's worth it. It's just all the more worth it. Every single car I've had, it was always white on white. I've never had any other color. That's just your style. I just love the white on white. Yeah. Like, I wish I can get it paint match, but that's very expensive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hotel room looking not too shabby out here. Don't expect more from tonight. We are drained. On to show day. Tokyo drift scene that's about to happen. We're about to roll into the underground parking garage and I'm about to see a bunch of action yeah. happening. Holy cow, I see it all in there. Dang. You're our version of Twinkie in the movie. Although this is a lot cooler than Twinkie's Hulk mobile. No offense to the Hulk mobile. Yo. Get me in, please. <laughs> They're like, how do you open this thing? This private entry kind of wild. Because I have to do everybody's job. <laughs> <laughs> they, they can't figure out how to open the gate. When you gotta open your own gate for yourself. Poor man. Yo, help our boy Lendl out. What's up, guys? What's up, man? Where's the R8? Oh, not this time. <laughs> Ooh. Dude, that's a rare kit on that 350Z. This is this is sick. This is so There's sick. There's so many cars. What up, what up? I've seen you before. <laughs> Yo. What's up, did man? Did he just pick you up? Yeah, he did. Oh, this is the Uber time. for today. What up? My name is Quan. Nice to meet you. I'm Owen. I'm Jack's Owen? friend. Yeah. His friend? Yeah. 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 Nice to meet you, his friend. <laughs> nice to meet you, his friend. <laughs> I, I gave you Welcome my name. to Toronto. Yeah. You know it's hot now, I don't know why, it's usually cold, but yeah. This is this is hype. 
Huh? I will later when I get the chance. <laughs> they got homies on the. What are you doing on the scooters? <laughs> oh, he getting the action. <laughs> he getting the action. <laughs> this is as raw tuner show as it gets. This is crazy. We're reaching. We're on the above ground. Oh my God. Hello. <laughs> Dude, the amount of people that have said what's up so far is yeah. wild too. Well, wait until they actually see you out of the car. <laughs> Dude, where are we right now? This is, this is, this is car heaven, honestly. This yeah. is a show. This is, this is a real show. Finish wrapping up doing our podcast out here, and then I look behind me, and we got a whole bunch of fans just showed up out of nowhere. What is going on? Yo, we found Drake in Toronto. Dude, Drake's in Toronto. Yo, how much you want to go up and ask him for a photo? Oh my God. Hey, Drake, I need a pic. Drake, I gotta go meet you at the six. Bro, I love your new album, dude. It's so good. Drake, I love Donda. It's so good. Take me with you. So tell us about this thing. You guys tell me. Me tell you? Alright, uh, here's the first thing. My eyes gravitate towards the SSR three-piece wheels right here. Those are some good Johnnies right down there. I also noticed that you have top mount twins. One, two, two J, Z. <laughs> Extreme wide body with the sound system and the bags. I mean... I don't know what more you could do to this IS. This reminds me of some Yanomai's type beat on this thing. Oh my, <laughs> it looks like a swimming pool back here. <laughs> you would think that I found some water in front of me. Nah, we just in front of some blue chrome. Man, if I was ever gonna do it, I do gotta know now that someone beat me to it. TE37s on the C8. Literally the coolest way to do it too. Bronze on red. I completely admire this man's taste. I gotta say, he rocking with the clears. So this is what it's like cruising in a real boat of a machine. He's got one of my favorite body kits on this thing, the Liberty Walk Type 2. Because you got the insane chassis mounted wing in the back and you got the canards up in front. This is pretty wild. This car has a literal fog machine. I've never seen someone do that for show. Whoa, what's that thing doing? He literally has his own car propped up on top of his car. You know, I don't think they overdid it at all. No, not one bit. I love these colors. Cotton candy machine. This thing makes me miss my 350Z. That was once black that I once had, but it was nowhere near on this guy's level. How much would you say that you've spent on the wheels? Oh, the wheels are easily worth over 10. Oh, <laughs> 10. No tires. I mean, this is some carbon fiber right on there. And then he's got his own brand in the center caps. As you go down, you rub tire because I'm static. And it just, that's how it is. <laughs> Wait, I didn't even know. You're static? Yeah, this is sucks. What? What's your like favorite little detail about this car? That's a loaded question. <laughs> oh, I know I it like is. That if we're talking like details, it's like the stuff that I did like myself. So like the center caps that I got through a like that's a cool detail that most people now won't even understand like they don't know what wheel brand it even is now yeah exactly so that causes like some attraction to want to talk about it like, yeah this I did was spray paint when I first cut the car and made the frame gold oh wow wow that is super detailed this is probably the coolest detail that's Chimera's signature that the owner of Rocket Bunny where did you that. find him for him to sign that he came to um, Driven last year with Next Mod, so these guys, they're really oh. good friends with him. So he came, walked around the car, gave it the signature of approval. Like that was by far probably the coolest moment. Yeah. 
he walked around it like his broken English he's such a nice guy too like yeah. so down to earth tries to communicate to you as best as he can and he walked around the car and just in his way was giving me like the good for you which was really cool dude you, you can't get rid of this thing this is like the no, coolest Z this, this is rad mission here at Driven Show is to shop around and look around and see what the next project build could be for the channel. Lexus SC, different variant of JDM with a JZ in it. I know a lot of people think that they're ugly, but I actually really like SCs. For sale. What do you think, Owen? Should we should we cop this thing? Dude, add an R33 to the channel. Yeah, we go Habsies on it. Is it? Oh, it is a GDR. Or it's, it? it's got the GDR badge. I don't, it, whether it's an actual GDR. Okay, usually you could tell by the fender width. If this had really wide fenders, then I would be quick to call this a GDR. But judging by the profile, I don't think it is, frankly. I mean, he's not running the badge in the back either. So I think it's just an R33 Skyline. But it would be cool for a next budget project to add an R33 to the channel. We have at last found Canada's American muscle segment here, full of none other than only Dodge Challengers. How much do you think these gold wheels are? They're probably, they're definitely oh. above 10K, oh, probably 15. like 12, $15,000 wheels. And you cannot change that, they are gold forever. Oh my God, you get, <laughs> this is so much. Damn, Robbie's too popular. I can't freaking even, I can't even go up to this man. Super rare body kit, and I love how it turned out on his car. The van. The minivan. <laughs> Dude, I can't, I can't even explain how small these wheels are. Around me, around me. All right, can you do Jim Connor style if I slowly move it over? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Oh, we got a moving object. Dude, I get, I get sent a lot of cool drawings, but this is on a whole nother level. Like, it's all balanced out. This one's like for you. Are you, are you sure? And then this one, can you sign this one? Oh wow, there's an, oh my god. Right here? Yes sir. Boom, let's go. <laughs> Best of show, this is nuts. Oh my god. What's up man? No. What's up? I, I've been a huge fan, bro. I've been watching your Forza videos. Dude, thank you, man. Yo, can we get this, please? No. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. You're my fucking role model, bro. I appreciate it, man. Yo, Owen, it's on and no one's in it. You could go swipe a cop car today. When you're down that you're stuck with your mid-2000s Toyota Camry, just slap on some work VSSS wheels, get that thing slammed, get those fenders rolled, and ba-boom. Sometimes you can work with what you got. You'll end up with something still super sick. Go long? Yeah! Imagine you just like hit his son and crack it. <laughs> That'd be awful. You can't do my boy Lendl like that. 1%. 1%? You're playing it close right now. Dude, go. you know what time it is? Hmm. It's golden hour, baby. Dude, who wants to shoot? It's time to put the video away and start snapping some photos for that Instagram, which you guys should totally follow, by the way. <laughs> on the vintage 501. Said he'd start it up for us. Uh-oh, uh -oh, what did we start? <laughs> you want me to sign that? Yeah, is that fine? Look, I'll make you a deal. I'll only sign this if you shoot another flame. Did I shoot a flame? Yeah, if you shoot another flame. Okay, I'll try. <laughs> Probably good, you don't make them too upset. But yeah, you got one, you got flame out of there. What's a real funny song? Don't, we're not playing a funny song, I'm not clowning. You're not gonna make him, you're not gonna clown. the homie, I'm not clowning. That's true. Seriously, what's a good song though? 
I'll let you come up with it. I have to look at my phone. <laughs> we got, so we got the DJ booth up in here. Yo, you have the song class? <laughs> I don't have one yet. He tried to force me to find one, so I'm thinking. Yo, come on, Owen. This is your moment. Any song in the world to blast through all of Ontario, Canada. No, I can't fuck this up. <laughs> I really can't fuck this up. He tries to run off, I talk to Drake over his band. Yeah, too bad I got the night because I'm fan. Man, we get to like Uber pulling up again. Our boy Lendl, he is the plug for this trip. I just, I just take the jacket. No, <laughs> no warmth for you. Toronto gets cold at night. That's what I'm learning right now. I'm, I'm actually like lost for words. That's sick. The evolution of the handicapped man. I don't really know what to summarize this as. We're gonna move on.